Hi, I'm Jenny, a Director of Art and Energy. When our partners at Plymouth Energy Community told us that the theme for this year's International Day of Cooperatives was climate action, we just knew we wanted to be involved. I put together creative packs and sent them out to eight members of our collective. We then met up one evening via Zoom for a project update and a bit of a tutorial. Each participant painted their design onto a square of glass and then returned them to me. I'm going to add solar cells and combine them to create a single, large, interactive solar artwork. In the next week or so, I'll be sending out creative packs to more of our collective. Hello, I'm Chloe and I'm one of the founders of the Art and Energy Collective. We came up with the idea of the Moths to Flame project because we wanted to create something for COP26 in Glasgow to tell world leaders that we really care about responding to the climate emergency. Hi, I'm Dave. Hi, I'm Jo. And we're from Laser Cuts Limited. Hi, my name's Ali, I'm part of Art and Energy. I'm Mary from Solar Power Education. I'm Ian. I'm part of Art and Energy. Hello, my name's Ray and I'm proud to work for Plymouth Energy Community. Hi, my name's Miranda Barlow. I've written and illustrated a children's book called The Moth's Whisper for the Art and Energy Project Moths to a Flame. This is our piece that we're putting in for the Moth to a Flame collaborative artwork project. This is the moth that I've created this week for the installation. This is my scalloped oak moth that I've painted on the back of a piece of glass to add to our cooperative artwork. My hope is to combine new technologies with the simple joy of making. We want everybody to work together for a cleaner, greener future. My hope is that we can bring about change in how we make our energy so that animals, birds and insects can thrive alongside us. My hope is that we look at the power of a momentary encounter with nature and to question how we can use that power to care just a little bit more about our use of what we have. My hope for the future is that we can raise awareness and provide education and share our passion and commitment to making this world a healthier, greener, a more positive place to live with a sustainable future. My hope for the future is that we can find ways to reconnect to our environment, to really appreciate its beauty and to understand the changes that we need to make in order to protect it. My hope for the future is that we can find ways to be creative in response to our energy challenge and that we can find a way to have a better relationship with ourselves, with our communities and with our planet. If there's one thing it's made us realise, it's quite how many amazing people we're working with. As with most of our projects, the final piece is already evolving, but that's the joy of having lots of lovely people cooperating together creatively. Let's cooperate and invite everyone to fight for climate change.